mem amak kutka kramanik um nuki ga maya mak nuri lak apa jam kamga amka nem nang ampa nem nang mebua inok raka kalam kara nem ya orama biang megik That's good news. Nane kari maraka amkam. Ja uklibik. Me marak neba. Ja kipem guana. Tell the captain that I'll be back on the bridge as soon as I've done his errand. Yes, sir. Good to have you aboard. I'm Lieutenant Silas, second in command of the Black Talon. We're your ride to Drom and Cass. I'm sure the ship will suffice. How long until we reach the planet? Shouldn't be more than a day. The Black Talon makes this run on a regular basis without much trouble. We're primarily a transport. In the meantime, your droids in the conference room we picked it up with the upgrades from Geonosis. When we docked here, it mentioned your names. If my droid's waiting, then I should see what it wants. Feel free to bother the crew if you need anything else. I'll be on the bridge. And you, soldier, when you're done playing Honor Guard, get back to your post. This isn't a luxury yacht. Yes, sir. Identity confirmed. Good day. I'm Advanced Protocol Unit NRO2. My functions are diplomacy, translation, manslaughter, and calumniation. 
I have an urgent message for you from my master. Please stand by for delivery. Who's your master, and how does he know I'm here? This is Unit NR02 to Grand Moff Kilrin. You are now in contact with the Black Talon. Well, so I am. And it seems you've brought me just the people I've been looking for. My name is Rikus Kilrin. I'm commander of the Fifth Fleet, second to the Minister of War, and my personal favorite, the so-called Butcher of Coruscant. I don't understand. What's going on here? It's apparent I need another pair of hands, so I asked NR2 to check the ship's passenger manifest. My good fortune that I was in a position to contact you. I was already aboard the Black Talon. Six hours ago, the Republic engaged in an illegal border skirmish on the edges of Imperial territory. One enemy warship escaped. That warship, the Brentel Star, is carrying a passenger of vital strategic importance. Yours is the only vessel placed to intercept. Where do I come in? I'll explain in a moment. The warship's passenger is codenamed the General. We don't know his identity, but the Republic believes he possesses military secrets, our military secrets. I trust the reports. The General must be captured or killed. Captain Orzik, the man commanding your transport, doesn't share my enthusiasm. He's disobeyed my orders to attack. Feel free to show him what the Empire does to cowards. Then commandeer his ship, find the Brentel Star, and deal with the General. Sounds interesting, but you realize I don't work for free. I certainly understand, as will the Imperial Treasury. We need individuals like you if we're to survive the next Great War. I will lead the way to the bridge. Once Captain Orsic is deposed and our hijacking is complete, we may proceed to the Brentall Star. Excellent. Then I will proceed. Move aside immediately. Halt! This is a restricted area. Captain Orzik's command. You'll have to leave immediately. Looks like it's your turn to die now. Blasters out! Attack! Attack! Proceed to the bridge immediately.
concerned about the loss of life, I assure you, the deaths of all injured crew members will be strategically insignificant. Buster. All Marines have been neutralized, scanning for additional threats. What's going on? Sir, stay calm, Ensign. Everyone stay calm. No threats found. The bridge is now secure. Who's calling the shots here? I'm Captain Revenant Orzik. I'm pretty sure I know what this is about. For the record, I take complete responsibility for my actions. Captain Orzik, I'm told you've disobeyed a direct order from Grand Moff Kilrun. Yes, I had no idea he'd respond this brutally. He must want the Brentel Star's passenger pretty badly. Maybe he just hates me. The Black Talon would be destroyed chasing a battleship. I've fought in the war before and I'll fight again, but I don't do suicide missions. Suicide was deciding you could ignore your superiors. The captain's dead. The captain's dead. Shut up. You have our attention, my lord. What would you have us do? Someone clean up this mess. We have business to take care of. But what about the... You have your instructions. In accordance with Article 27A of the Imperial Code of Military Conduct, 
Command of this vessel has been lawfully transferred. New orders are being downloaded to your consoles. Priority one, intercept the Brenthal Star. Pekara, do as the droid says and prepare to jump to light speed. It's emerging from hyperspace now. One Thranta class warship on the scanners. Powering up. Enemy is firing. Plasma lasers, missiles, and looks like transport pods. I'm not sure. The pods are a distraction. Return fire. Aim for their power generators. So long as they're damaged and we're not, we have the advantage. Lieutenant. Captain Silas, sir. Engineering is reporting blast of fire. They just cut out. I'm giddy with anticipation. Damn it. It must be some sort of boarding action. If they're in engineering, they could destroy this ship. With due respect, I recommend you lend a hand down there. It's a done deal. I'll notify security. And don't worry. We won't let those Republic scum get away. Security forces have placed in your cargo area to enforce containment measures. Please respond.
have an emergency. Please respond. The droids locked us out of the control room. They're sabotaging the engine. If you can hear this, please return to the bridge. We need you. Damage reports from all decks. We're holding together, sir, but I don't know for how long. Make sure it's long enough, Ensign. Your life and career are at stake. Please stand alert. Grand Moff Kilran's representatives have returned. Congratulations, my lord. Security reports that the sabotage droids have been destroyed. Fill me in on the situation. We've penetrated the Brental Star's outer defenses. Their next assault won't come until we enter fighter range. Another minute, maybe two. Transmission coming in. Long range. 
It's a message, but it's not from the Brentle Star. Put it through, Ensign. This is Jedi Grand Master Satil Shan hailing unidentified Imperial vessel. I'm en route to your location with 16 Republic vessels. I'm asking you to retreat before more lives are lost. Disregard the transmission. Continue closing on the Brentol Star. Understood. Maintaining course and speed. The Brentol Star is under my protection. Our convoy was ambushed and I sent the star ahead. We will reunite. I just crippled three Imperial Dreadnoughts. I don't wish to destroy you. The peace between Republic and Empire is fragile enough already. Tell the Brentel Star to hand over the General. No one needs to be hurt. The General has a role to play with the Republic. Incidents like this are happening across the galaxy, but only because we let them. Leave the Brentel Star to me. If you don't, then may the Force be with you. Because the men and women aboard that ship can hold you off until we arrive. And you will be defeated. You're deluding yourself. The ship is already mine. You've made yourself clear. But I suggest you prepare to face a Jedi. And you may want to consider what that means. Entering fighter range. The Brentel Star is launching its first squadron. All right. Now we're close enough to fly in and send a raiding party. I assume you're going. Whatever's necessary to finish this. We'll be awaiting your successful return. I advise that you proceed to the shuttle bay. The flight to the Brentol Star may be hazardous, but Grand Moth Kilran has complete faith in your abilities. Try to be more careful.
Looks the pretty sidekick, Buster. This is Protocol Unit NRO2. I hope you're receiving this message clearly, and that your flight was free of incident. Please hold for Security Coordinator Ensign Bukhara. The Marines are on their way. They'll follow you in and hold each junction you secure. Try not to take too long. We're not a military ship. What you have is all you're getting. I don't need an army. I can handle this myself. Yes, but... I understand. I have been scanning the Brenton Star's communications, and security forces appear to be moving to protect the escape pods. It is extremely likely that the crew is attempting to evacuate the General. You must retrieve or eliminate him before he escapes. I don't need a droid telling me how to do things. Understood. I am simply looking after Grand Moff Killerin's interests. I will be in contact if the situation changes. Proceed to assault all defense points between you and the target. You're speaking to a special forces commander, Meat. Show some respect.
think you're tough meat. Ah, part of me was hoping you'd try to board this ship. Attack! For the Republic!
just had to put my mind to it. Pods aren't far now. You can make it on your own, General. And what about you? I will face my destiny. Go now, my friend. Halt where you are. I am Yadira Ban, Padawan of the Jedi Order. I was sent to protect the General, and you will not pass. Your master sent you? Really? My first teacher tried to kill me, too. Then it's true. You Sith are a mockery of everything the Jedi believe in. But I intend to drive you back, meter by meter if need be. Just as the Republic pushed the Sith Empire into the dark of the galaxy. It makes no difference to me. You're keeping me from my target. I hope one day you'll see beyond your selfish desires. But I cannot be the one to teach you. Or you may stand with the ground, but you'll go no farther. You aren't going to win this, I swear it.
Put aside your weapons. I won't try to run. Besides, I doubt I'd make it to an escape pod without my intestines spilling out. I might just spill your intestines myself. I don't need you alive. I'm well aware of Imperial policy regarding my kind. I was a general in the Imperial Military Service. Did they tell you that when they sent you here? Did they even know? I hope the Republic's paying you awfully well for this. If you knew what I knew, you'd understand. If you'd heard what both sides are plotting, you wouldn't be eager to restart this war. They're building doomsday weapons, shields that envelop planets, missiles that darken suns. Republic and Empire are planning to raise worlds, annihilate civilizations. It will be unlike anything the galaxy's seen since the Great Hyperspace War. Then it's too late to stop it. The so-called peace is already lost. There will be bloodshed on a massive scale, and I will be part of it. At the start, yes. But you won't survive. <laughs> None of us will. Oh, you have me then. Me, my stomach full of blood, and my implant full of cybernetic secrets and stolen plans. <laughs> what will you do? I'm gonna bring you to my ship. From there, you'll be transported to Drummond Kaas and taken into Imperial custody. Where I'll be tortured or executed, or at best, placed in a cell for the rest of my life. Still, there's nowhere in the galaxy where I could truly hide. I will follow you. This is Protocol Unit NRO2. If you are receiving this message, I urge you to return to the Black Talon as quickly as possible. Explain yourself. What's going on? There has been an incident aboard the bridge. Your tactics have inspired. Idiots! Get us all damn well killed!
Welcome back. I'm pleased to see that you have returned whole. I do apologize for the condition of the bridge. As I'd intended to explain earlier, there was an incident. You better tell me what happened, or I'm going to be very unhappy. Several of the crew were extremely agitated by your behavior. Ensign Hedder feared you might execute anyone who failed to contribute to the mission. A group of officers attempted to flee the ship before you returned. Lieutenant Silas objected, and a firefight broke out. There was a large number of casualties, but don't worry. I am fully capable of piloting the ship back to Dromund Kars. You're telling me they panicked and killed one another? That is correct. It was unexpected. Grand Moff Kilrin is eagerly awaiting your report. Should I put him through? Go ahead. There's no sense waiting. Opening channel now. Well, how fortunate I could reach my friends aboard the Black Talon. The droid's been keeping me appraised of your work, but I very much wanted to hear from you. How did the attack go? The Bental Star has been disabled, and the General captured. He'll be on your hands soon. Excellent. I'll let Korriban and Imperial Intelligence fight over him. You should be proud. This is only one of the many operations we're conducting across the galaxy. It's a new beginning to the war. The General was one of the greatest weapons the Republic had. A defector. And you've snatched him from enemy hands. I'll remember this, and I'll make sure you're rewarded. No trouble. This is how I make my living. Of course. And the Empire can always use more dedicated mercenaries. But my words hardly matter. Soon you'll be joining us on the homeworld, and you can see for yourself what you've been fighting for. It should be inspiring. Enjoy the rest of your journey. Kilwin out. <laughs>